Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in the past few days, I've been um, seeing some messages in my WhatsApp group where people are saying their wallets have been hacked, they, they can no longer access or have see their coins. They slept and they woke up and um, they cannot see, they can no longer see their coin. So I'm making this video on how to actually protect your um, trust wallet, all right? Now, one of the best ways is not to give out your seed and words. That's the first step. Don't give it out to anyone and just store it in a place that only you have access to, except you want to pass it to or someone else. All right, that's the first step. Don't give out. Just when you are signing up on this app, you are being provided with 12 words. Those words have access to your, um, that is anyone that has, access to that those words can actually log into your account on trust wallet all right so the second um step is you open your trust wallet you see settings at the last thing here so tap it tap settings now you see security tap security all right tap security and activate this transaction signing this will actually um give you a notification or rather um um kind of like every transaction that is ca being carried on on your trust wallet we need you to confirm it so this is the first step so once you turn on this any transaction is that uh, that's that about to take on that's about to be done on your trust wallet we need you to confirm it with either your code or your biometric if you activate it the second step is go to your dab browser dab app look at it at the down at the down part here dab app touch it now there is a website which i will show you just allowance.bfinance uh, finance all right now this actually helps you to revoke um address that you have given permission to let me show you so if you want to access this site just tap allowance.bc.finance then you go on your dark browser all right now connect this change this at the top here change this change this to binance smart chain Now you can see the the address that has um on that has unlimited access to my to my account. It means they can take anything they want to take anytime, any day. So you see it. Now click on it to see if it's actually um an address that you still want to continue your your transaction with. All right, so you can see. So if you no longer want to continue the transaction with this, all you have to do is delete it or revoke it. All right. You can see all the information you want to see about this. So all you have to do is go back, sorry, allowance.com login changes to be all right now you don't want to continue with this you don't want them to have any access to your token again so you click on revoke once you click on revoke and you approve it should be revoked let me show you approve let me go back approve you can see that it's been revoked all right so if you do this your account will be saved so from time to time you can just log into this site and revoke the address that you don't want on your account again.
and you also make sure to turn on your permission that's on your settings the security turn on the transaction sign and also one other thing is you know there is rising um um airdrop um address all this stuff so just to be on the safer side have another um you can actually create two here let me show you you can actually add another wallet here so just have another wallet that doesn't have any access that like you want to do a drop then use that um that's a wallet for just a drop and then have another separate um account another separate trust wallet for your own savings to be on a safer side all right now if you're not subscribed to my channel please do it and subscribe because i'm going to be sharing more and more interesting things on my channel all right see you in my next video